we've got wine tasting events, we've got all sorts of things. Sharks puck. Yeah, you can win a Sharks puck signed by one of the Sharks players. A showstopper here at the uh, uh, car show. Yep. And why don't you just tell us a little bit about your... Well, this is the third year that the car's been entered in this show. The first year it won an award for best hot rod. Last year it won an award for the best paint job. Wow, that's pretty good. So I got to be one of the judges for the best paint job for this year. Because yes. I guess they think I must know something about the paint. So I do. So what about the paint? Uh, it's a special process called three-stage paint. It's very expensive. That's about $25,000 for the paint job. Oh, wow. After the car's been prepared to have it painted. And uh, it's really difficult to do. A lot of painters will not even attempt to do it. But as I you can, can see, see the why. results, yeah, right? Wow. Yeah. And uh, then, of course, it's a matter of taking care of it and preparing it and making you it look good. You said 25000 yeah, just for the paint job. Yeah. How much is the car worth? Paint it's insured for $150,000. That's the replacement value. And I, I had no problem with the appraisal. The insurance company looked at it and said, no problem. And so now uh, you have this car, and how much time does it spend in your garage uh, uh, backyard versus uh, driving around? Well, that's what's interesting. I did have somebody walk by a while ago, and they looked at my car and said, oh, another trailer queen, which is what we call cars that don't run, that they're just taken for shows. And I corrected him. I said, no, this car is 13 years old. It's got 20,000 miles on it, and I drive it to all the shows and sometimes just for fun. And it never goes on a trailer, it's driven everywhere. It has a complete vinyl cover that goes over the front to protect it from rocks. But yes, it gets driven quite often. And it's cranking about 525 horsepower. Which enables you to do what? Probably has about 300 horsepower more than I really need for a car like this. But uh, it goes uh, from 0 to 60 in 2.8 seconds. And uh, it's uh, been a, just a tremendously fun car to own. Wow. And it, but you, you must uh, sort of worry a little bit about it. Somebody looked backing into you or the insurance, as I, we mentioned, must be terribly. I keep a blind eye to a lot of that, uh, you know, because there's a lot of kids that come around to these car shows. And, yeah, and they're always full of ice cream hands and they want to lean over and they're putting spots all over it but that's just part of the show you just grin and bear it and, and you just hope they don't do you take this bucket. car to Safeway no Safeway is off limits for the car <laughs> and then I'm in the registration line and the uh, temperature gauge went to the top yes. and what happened is uh, the alternator bracket bolt broke just like that just like that so I'm going to have it towed home and then my buddy's going to come over and tap it the hole out, tap the hole out, put a new bolt in and I'll be driving it right then. It's part of having a hot rod. Things always happen. It's so much fun. I had met a guy down here. He said, if you need a ride home, I'll tow it home for you in my trailer. I mean, just really wonderful people. I think the car has something to do with it too. Yeah. But anyway, thank Good. you. You bet. Have a great day, and it's a lot of fun. Yes, it is. It's always yes, fun. Is. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am.